what's up, Facebook? I'm Will Gans with Good Morning America, and I am here with Kelsey Valerie. Hi! How Hi, are guys! You? What's up? Thanks for waking up early with us oh, this morning. Oh, it's so early. It's good, though. And you were, were you performing last night where I was looking at your Twitter? You didn't get a whole lot of sleep. Didn't get a whole lot of sleep. Um, no, my flight was just super delayed from Nashville. The worst. But it was a good hang in the airport, good airport hang, you know? Yeah, everybody needs a good airport hang. Go. It's true. Don't. <laughs> just go run on through. There You're you good. go. We're backstage. There's no rules. There's every, yeah, everything's happening. Um, so, so, let's talk about the first time. Okay. It's doing incredibly well. Congratulations. Thanks. Thank you. Um, I love Billboard called you country's next queen. Why do you think people are connecting so well with this album? Gosh, I don't know. I'm glad they are. You know, when I was writing the album, I started writing songs when I was 12, and I put it out last year when I was 21. And, um, I really just tried to write songs about my life, and I feel like because I tried to dig into, like, that truth, um, people related to that quicker, you know? Because I was just writing the truth about my life. You're honest, and you have writing credits on every yeah. song on the album. Yeah. What does songwriting mean to you? What does it do for you? Um, I think for me, it's just kind of a place to kind of just vent, whether it's good or bad or whatever, just kind of have that safe place to be honest. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cool, cool. So tell me a little bit about the songs that you're performing today. We've got Peter Pan. Peter Pan. That's like incredibly popular. Climbing, climbing, climbing. Yes. Um, what is Peter Pan about? And the video too, how there's... The video is very I'm like dramatic. getting very excited, but there's like secret messages. There on is, there is. Well, I mean, everyone knows the story of Peter Pan, the boy who can't grow up. Um, it's like that, that classic fairy tale. So we just kind of related it to... I wrote it with two of my friends and we... Sat in the room and talked about relationships that we had had where, you know, one person just is kind of a little more immature than the other. And um, we wrote this song about that. And in the video, we wanted to kind of make it epic and like a storyline, but also have like little clues that allude to the movie and allude to like that, that classic story. So um, it's my favorite song we've gotten to put out so far. So we're doing that one, and then we're doing Dibs, which I got to do last time I performed on GMA. And then we're doing Love Me Like a Minute, which is my first single. Amazing. Yeah. Um, all right. I want to talk also about your... First solo headlining tour. Oh, yeah, this fall. Yeah, tell me about it. What can fans expect? <laughs> um, well, you know, I've gotten to open for a lot of my favorite artists the last few years, and I've, I've just watched them every night, and I feel like I've learned so much about how to be a performer from them, and um, it's been cool to kind of watch my, my fan base grow from, like, one or two people in every audience knowing a song or two to, you know, a, like half knowing songs. It's really cool. So, um, yeah, I, we, I just wanted to get up close and personal with people, and, yeah, it'll be fun. And that's what that's what you're gonna do. Yeah, absolutely. Where, where can folks get tickets? Uh, KelseyBallardy.com. Easy enough. Like Facebook. Dates, <laughs> so see you there. <laughs> um, amazing. I want to talk a little bit too. You're the first. Uh, I want to get this stat right. Female artist in 15 years to hit number one with your first two country singles. That's true. What has surprised you the most about that. this trip? <laughs> <laughs> that surprises me. Yeah. I don't know. It's crazy. I mean, gosh, I, I grew up, like, looking up to people like Carrie Underwood and Miranda Lambert and to, to be in, like, categories with them now. So I don't <laughs> really cool. <laughs> yeah. Um, I also want to ask about your writing style. I was reading, and you said, I mean, obviously, being from Tennessee influences yeah. your writing style, but you also live. Well, I think, you know, I grew up in East Tennessee on a farm, mm -hmm. so I think my roots are just naturally really, really like country and southern, um, but yeah, I, I love pop music, I love classic music, and I think that as a songwriter, listening to every genre really inspires me to, to be a better writer just in general, not a certain genre, um, and I think too, country music is really expanding right now with other influences, so it's, it's been cool to kind of push that boundary a bit. And we are glad that you have been pushing Thanks. the boundary. Thank All right, y'all, Kelsey Ballerini, performing on GMA in just today. a couple minutes. Today. 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 Multiple songs, you don't want to miss it. And then, if that's not enough for you, which I guarantee it won't be once you hear these songs, get tickets to the You're tour. Nice. Yes, I'm coming to New York too, so I'll be back. You have to come. I will, I'll be there. Will you dress up as Peter Pan? I have never been more excited for anything in my life. It's gonna yeah. happen. I'll be in the front row in green tights. <laughs> Done. Promise. The deal is sealed right here. Here we right go. Right here. You just saw it happen. <laughs> All right, Facebook. We'll see Kelsey and